The jungle regions of our planet are some of the most interesting, mainly because there's so many areas that are unexplored. Today researchers are discovering lost civilizations beneath the jungle, giving us a better understanding of human history, while at the same time rewriting what we currently know. Some of these discoveries have caused researchers to question timelines, but it's not just ancient discoveries and new animal species that are being made in these locations. For the last 100 years people have claimed they've encountered animals that are not known to science. Although thousands of new species are discovered every year, these creatures have only been seen on a few occasions, and when researchers have ventured back in the jungle to find them, there appears to be no trace of them. One of these mysteries is that of the spiny backed chimpanzee, a mysterious humanoid that has been reportedly seen in the Democratic Republic of Congo, and it's been suggested by some researchers that the billy ape is the creature responsible for the encounters. This ape is described as being large in size, having a broad face, not making much noise and not being afraid of humans. Unlike other cryptids in the area, the alleged sightings of this mysterious creature are quite recent. The creature has been around for a while now, and everybody who encounters it describes the same thing. According to one encounter by a navy officer who wanted to remain anonymous, his unit encountered 13 strange bipedal chimpanzees. The group of chimpanzees were trying to take down other animals, but the soldiers said they were able to identify how tall they were, saying that they measured between 4 and 6 feet tall, and were a grey colour. However, the most distinctive feature of these chimpanzees was the series of spines on their back. Whenever these chimps became agitated, the spines on their back stood up like a porcupine. One of the navy officers who saw this also stated that his team member made a 3 minute video of the strange animals, but that the video was never released to the public, and it remains a military secret. The officers did not give an exact location, but it's believed that the sighting was made somewhere near Lake Tangayeka, in the Democratic Republic of Congo. spiny pack chimpanzee is one of the strangest creatures ever reported, and the researchers believe that the jungles of Africa could potentially host hundreds of unexplored species. The spiny pack chimpanzee could be an undiscovered species with a very small population, and could very well be extinct by now. Some have linked this creature to the billy ape and have suggested they're the same thing. The only thing that's different about this creature and the billy ape is that of the spines. However, as some have pointed out, the billy ape was once thought to have been a cryptid and not a real creature. But fast forward a few decades and scientists were able to prove that it was in fact a real animal. Some have suggested that the same could happen with the spiny back chimpanzees. There are many areas of the Congo that haven't been explored, and somewhere out there there could be lurking a new species of ape that matched the description of the spiny back chimpanzees. The soldiers haven't come forward with any more details, with researchers who have looked into the case saying that it's likely they were told to be quiet. As mentioned, some have suggested that the spiny back chimpanzees could be Billy Ames, a creature that was originally thought to not exist. Over a century ago, Belgian colonizers found a large primate skull during their rampage, and this was in the northern Congo. The locals would tell them stories of a mysterious large ape that would attack and eat lions. Gorillas were never found in this region of northern Congo, so researchers and explorers were confused and intrigued. They believed it to be an entirely new species of ape, although they never found any additional evidence or proof of life. The skull was promptly left to collect dust in the Royal Museum for Central Africa and Belgium. This was until the 1990s, when Carl Amann read about them in a scientific article. He was a Swiss-born photographer and devoted conservationist. Enraptured by the skull's puzzle, he set off on an adventure through the dense jungles. The Billy Whaler tropical forest covers 12,000 square miles, and is a mix of thick canopy and large stretches of savanna. 
the researchers had to trek through an impenetrable underbrush full of ants, mosquitoes and bees that were drawn to their sweat end. Despite being such a difficult undertaking, a man ended up repeatedly visiting the forest over the span of 10 years, with various rangers, camera crews and researchers. On his first trip he found another ape skull, which only increased his obsession. In 2004, American primatologist Cleve Hicks joined the search. He spent weeks travelling through the forest in the hopes of finding the Ames. He and his team set up motion detecting cameras and eventually captured images of the elusive Billy Ames. As it turned out, they were not a new species, they were chimpanzees. However, they were unlike any chimpanzees the researchers had seen before. They had larger skulls. Their behaviour was unique in that they nested on the ground, like gorillas instead of the canopy. They also used the longest tools researchers had seen in Africa, and they did this to collect ants and honey. On one expedition researchers came across a chimpanzee eating a leopard, although they weren't sure if the chimp had just found it. The locals called them the line destroyers, and explained that even their poison darts don't affect them. Hicks stated that they were the largest population of wild chimpanzees anywhere in the world. He said that they were curious of the humans rather than fearful, which led them to believe that they'd never seen humans before. Those that live closer to civilization would flee when approached, but the apes further in the world would gather close to observe, before quietly leaving. Since they live in such a remote part of the jungle, it was near impossible for poachers or other hunters to encounter them. Today though the forest is a hiding spot for many fugitives, and it's being turned into farmland. So what do you make of these mysterious creatures, and what do you think the spiny back chimpanzee is? Be sure to leave your questions and answers in the comment section below, and help us to grow this community while working to solve these unexplained mysteries. Thank you for watching and don't forget to subscribe for more videos.